What's up guys, KG, Rough To Be Buff TV. We're back with another vlog today. And what I wanted to talk about today is how I came up with the saying, rough to be buff. To make a long story short, I worked at 24 Hour Fitness about 11 years ago or 10 years ago. It was the tail end of 2006 going into 07. You guys know how it is. If you're a personal trainer and you're working at a commercial gym, you guys gotta go walk the floor and do a team clean, go pick up some weights. And um, if my buddy Sean, and Jeff are watching this. They were there the day that I came up with Rough To Be Buff. And it was really just a joke. I didn't come up with it on purpose or didn't like create some elaborate thought process to think about it, but we were re-racking weights, you know, just kind of killing time in between clients. Sean's standing there and Jeff's standing there and he's like, hey man, you know, how, how's your day going? And I, and I respond, I said, Jeff, man, it's rough. And he goes, Kyle, he goes, what do you mean? Rough, what do you mean it's rough? What's real rough? I said, well, it's rough being so damn buff. And we joke and you know, and he, he's like, you know, rough to be buff. That's, that's basically where it started. Um, and I've been saying it ever since. And in all seriousness, I've kind of lived by that motto. And I've told a lot of my clients that when they first start getting into fitness or start training, that it's a mindset that this stuff isn't easy. Getting into a fitness program, waking up early, eating, shopping, doing the due diligence that it takes to get where you want to get with your fitness or your physicality or whatever it may be is it's not going to be an easy process. There's going to be um, some harshness that's going to be tough. Um, there's going to be a lot of times where you don't want to do certain things, but the brass tacks of it is, is that you got to embrace that challenge. Embrace that it's going to be rough. It's easy to do nothing, you know, and that's the alternate course is you can sit by idle and do absolutely nothing. So that's how Rough To Be Buff started. That's pretty much what today's vlog is about, you know, and that's where I got the name for my channel. I didn't want to put it, my, my name on it, you know, I didn't want to call it like, you know, Kyle Gran or I didn't want to put, you know, KG Fit or I couldn't really think of a name for my YouTube channel when I started this thing a year ago. And then I'm um, like, what do I live by? You know, what do I always say to my clients? And uh, I immediately thought of Rough To Be Buff TV. And that's basically how the origins of this channel name started. So it's something I live by. And it's something I tell a lot of my clients or anyone getting into a fitness program. So that's how it started, guys. I'm gonna be in the Philippines, so I won't be posting for the next eight days or so. But I'm definitely, definitely, definitely going to get some content while I'm in the Philippines. I'm not too sure what I'm gonna record as far as fitness related. It may be food or the culture. I'm looking forward to this trip. I'm looking forward to coming back and kind of sharing uh, that experience with you guys. Thanks for tuning in. I'm KG. This is Rough To Be Buff TV. Peace.